No text back. Uh, yeah, she don't get no text. Uh, I don't want no sex, no. Uh, yeah, I just want that neck. Damn. Uh, I just want that neck, go. Oh, oh, baby, I don't want no sex. For all my females out there that's watching, comment below what you hate, like the names you hate the most when a guy is trying to holler at you or is trying to trying to get your attention because i asked my friend this i was like do you hate it when guys call you shorty or like ma or like hey baby or something like that or some females don't mind it but i know some females you know depending on what they say hate it but just i'm not i don't do that I'm I'm a gentleman first. You know. But I mean even 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 then, like even I, after I get to know you, I'm not about to just call you that either. So yeah. And then if anything, I'll ask if it's okay for me to call you a certain name. We got communication, we gotta talk about it. You know, but Where you at with yours? Um, somebody suggested this video. They said it's not scary, but it's emotional. I don't see the only thing about me getting getting emotional is like I don't like doing it. It's draining. It's 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 exhausting. And then it's kind of hard for me to get out of it if I go too too deep into it. Just saying. Like for my movie that I was in, like the independent feature film, the last, I don't want to give nothing away. There was a scene in there that I had to get emotional. We kept having to do the same take over and over again. And I had to stay in that state of mind of emotional, I had to stay in that emotional state. Oh, because when they yell cut, oh, let's do it again. Or hold, or run it back. I had to stay in that emotional state. That's exhausting. <laughs> oh God, but I think I did that. But no, nah, let's get it though. Sup, though. Wow, just. Oh my God! There's nobody you could have. Company, I'm trying to find an address for them. It's Murphy S M U R F I T. Oh, S E O N E. Hello, just trying to find what the address you're working for. We're trying to find it. Tell us the company again. My leg. Are you in the agitated by a builder? I'm sorry, sorry. I didn't That's crazy. Like I'm just picturing. Patiently, as always, not always, but like some now, like this, like stories like these, I will put myself into the into his situation. Like now, I'm doing that. I'm putting myself in his shoes. Whole time I'm on the phone talking to you, my my leg is gushing out blood. Like it's it's going, it's going. I need somebody here ASAP. This is why I don't really clock with police because they be taking too long, bruh. Man, especially and the ambulance. Do you know how many times I've I've been on a road and I've just seen ambulances with their lights on and being loud as hell, but driving slow as hell. 
Like, really? Like, the person in the back seat is probably dead. Sorry. Oh, that was a little... I'm so sorry. I did not mean to take it there. Or, like, the person, you know, that they're trying to get is probably... Mm, you feel me? Like, he's on the verge of dying. Meanwhile, he should have... There should have already been somebody that, like, come on, bro. Y'all take your precious time. Jesus. And I was going to say, there's not, like, he couldn't have called nobody else, like a friend or a family member or a co-worker or a neighbor or somebody to take him. Like, where the hell is he? Like, there's no, like, come on, man. Jesus. Did the, and did the story start off with... Sorry. Did it start off with his leg already amputated? Because I'm going to need some backstory on this. Was it? My leg? I think. I think it's amputated. Yeah, it's amputated. It's amputated. Sir? Uh, I'm available. And where are you located at, sir? My big stone. It's 7th Avenue and Recycle Boulevard. 7th Avenue and Recycle? Yes. Yes, sir. I just said it. Are you there by yourself, sir? No, sir, I'm not. But no one's hearing me. And I'm really losing blood, sir. I'm going to die. All right, sir. You're at uh, Recycle Center Drive? Yes, sir. Oh, my okay. God. Uh, 87th Avenue. And what business are you at, sir? Muffet Stone. Muffet Stone. Muffet, S-M-U-R-F-I-T. Muffet? Yes, damn! Okay. And do you have anything there you can control the bleeding with, sir? Sir, I have... Come on, bro. Come on. Yeah, they're on the way, sir. But do you, do you have anything at all you can use to control the bleeding? You just have to take your shirt off. I have my jeans wrapped up around it, sir. Okay. You don't have a tie as a tourniquet. You just have your holding pressure to it, right? Right. Okay. We're coming as fast as we can. I'm Are you? Phone with you, sir. So I think I'm going to pass out. Okay. Could you do me a favor? If I give you a phone number, can you call my mother? What is that number, sir? 407. Really? You had to do all that loud? You could've just... You could've just muted it. Just saying. Can you please tell her I said I love her? I'm not gonna die on her, but I love her anyways. Can you please tell her that? Yeah, we're coming, sir. You're not, and every, everything's gonna be all right. Okay. Everything's gonna be okay, okay? We're around on the bus, Yeah, after you're also around. Yes. Okay, we're coming as, coming as fast as we can. I don't think so. I want you to control the bleeding, sir, with your one hand, okay? Yes, sir, I'm controlling it, sir. Okay. Where on the property is this machine located? When you come in, uh -huh. you're going to go straight. You're going to see a building. If you keep going, you're Why is he acting so calm? I'm, I'm like, I get it. Not, I don't know. Because it's like... You got one of your body, like a limb. Is that what it's called? A limb? Like a hand? Arm? Elbow? Leg? Is that? You got one of your junks cut off. Right? I know for me, I know everybody is different. But I know for me, if I was to get my junk, anything cut off, especially to that extreme, I'm, I'm, oh my God, I'm being so loud. I am so loud. I am, oh my God. Oh, I can just imagine the pain. But it's weird because it's like, I don't know why he's acting so calm, but I know he's not calm. I don't know. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't know. I, how would you react if you was in his situation? I would be screaming my asshole. But, I guess 
everybody pain tolerance is different, but I'm saying like you got your leg is cut off. Like that's a big body, man. I don't know. Why is he acting so calm? I'm trying to give him the benefit of the doubt, but he acting a little sus right now, man. Why are you, why are you, man? I don't know. The big blue bear. Uh huh. They're in the middle of that bear. I'm not moving. Okay. So, how much blood do I have to lose before I die? Um, I don't know, sir, but that's fine. Just, just hold that shirt. Just continue to hold that shirt on there. Or I'm gonna die. No, you're not, sir. My mother is dead. I'm not gonna die soon as my mother is gonna kill me. Okay, we're, we're coming, sir. We're oh, coming. God. Huh? Why would your mother kill you? Have you called my mother? I haven't called her, sir. We will call her. Okay, thank you. Okay, sir. 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 I don't see any other call, sir. That's great. Yeah, I love these guys. Okay. Wow. Your coworkers do not care about you. Sir? Yeah, I'm here, sir. What is your name? My name's Chef, sir. Oh, you do. Okay, we're coming to you. Yeah. Sir, uh, just, we're coming to you. We can just keep talking to me. And use your other hand to uh, continue to control that lead. Okay. It sounds like he about to give up on life. Okay, go ahead, sir. I bring you all my sins I've ever committed. Oh, my. Here it comes. Don't let me die, but if I do that, I won't see you going to go to the good place. It's coming. I've done so much shit in my life, Lord. I've done so much. But, Lord, please just let me be okay. If I'm not okay, then neither is in heaven with you. Please give my mother keep her strong because I know she's not going to be happy. God, please let me get through this. Sir, I don't hear an ambulance or anything. They're, they're coming to test the cancer. Are you sure you have the right address? It's you know, an ambulance hospital. Do you see it in that area? Yeah, you're down off of um, where she go at. Yes, sir. Okay, we're coming as fast as we can, sir. We're coming as fast as we can. Are they going to have pain killer for me? So, yeah, if you're going to need it, they're going to they're gonna give you whatever you need, sir, okay? So I think I'm going to fall up. Oh, okay. Okay. Do you understand, sir? Yeah. Okay. Why does he keep saying his mother's going to kill him? Please don't let me die. Well, you're not going to die, sir. How are you doing with your, uh, with the control and the bleeding? It's pretty much stopped. But I don't okay. know how much longer I can keep my hand. Okay, sir. Well, what, well, that's fine. I understand because you're probably feeling faint, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Well, uh, that's why I want you to continue to talk to me. Okay? Then we'll keep my hand now. They're coming. To, they're just around the corner from you. Okay? okay. And what, what I want you to do is I want you to continue to continue to hold that pressure on there, even though you said the bleeding has stopped, okay? Sir? Yes, sir. I forgot about my dad. My, my dad, my stepdad, he adopted me. Mm -hmm. Please tell him I love him too. Yes, sir. What is your name? My name is John. John? Yeah, John right. Maynard. M A Y N A R D. Okay. So I'm gonna get so fucking fired. Uh, uh, sir, uh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The sheriff's office, we, we can't find him in the recycle center. Where about are you? Okay, he said he's all the way in the back behind you. So John, you're right, you're behind the building at the big blue machine, right? I'm in the blue machine, yes, sir. Did you copy that, SL? Yeah, right behind the building, okay. near a big blue machine? Big blue machine, yes. Okay. It has a. It has scales all around it, maybe a fortress out front, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Pretty great for me here, I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, no, I understand, I understand. The police are there now looking for you, okay? Sir, I'm gonna pass out. Okay, no, I want you to keep talking to me. You're gonna be fine. Hello? They're coming, Hello. John. John, they're coming. Sir. They're coming, John. Yes, John. John, stay with me. I'm touching me right now, too. Oh, okay. 
I'm sorry, what's that, John? Fine. I'm here, John. Stay with me. Sir? Yes, sir. Yes. I'm here. You're on. You're my You're coming. Oh, that, 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 that's fine. You're not here, right? Do you hear somebody? Do you hear somebody that out there? I hear somebody in the background. That's my coworker, Richie. Okay, he just found. Okay, so yeah. he just found you. John. Yeah. Your coworker just found you, right? Yeah, he just found me. Okay. So yeah. is he still there with you? No, he wants to get the police. Okay. Okay, sir. Yeah, that's I fine. Love, I love everybody. Okay, they're coming. They're coming as fast as they can. He passed out. John, you're going to be okay. We're going to help you. He they're, passed. They're coming. Good job. They're coming as fast as they can. He passed out. He's dead. Oh. Who? Oh. oh. I'm sorry, John. But yeah, we're here. I'm here, sir. Are you there? <coughs> yeah, I'm here. Please. You're talking to the police right now? Yes, sir. Okay. That's good. Sir? 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 Okay. Sir? Yes, sir. Are you talking to me or the police, John? I'm talking to both of you. Okay. Am I getting to the jail for this? I don't know. I don't... I don't... Hey, John. John. Yes, sir. Yes, all right. Sir. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Uh, what I need you to do, uh, is there one police officer with you or two? What? Is there one police officer or two there? How many police officers are there? This is a bailing machine, sir. I'm on the phone. Yes, sir. Okay, so he's telling me I can hang up with you now. You going to hang up with me? Okay. Yeah, he's all right. Me. All right. We're gonna, we can disconnect now, sir. Alright, John, they're gonna take they're gonna take good care of you, okay? Can you Yeah, I will take care of calling your mother. I'm gonna write you a letter and send you flowers. Okay. John, I'm gonna I'm gonna take care of take call your mother, okay? Sir, actually yeah. it might be smarter to call my dad because my mom will probably pass out. Okay, what is your mother your dad's phone number? Okay, I'm gonna hang up with you, sorry. Can you call my mom? Sorry, I gotta go. Okay, that's fine. John, what's your dad's name? Wait a minute. That's not, no, it's not over. Wait, what? Oh my God. There, oh. Mm. Yeah, I, I, I definitely um got emotional, Jesus. Um. Yo, these 911 calls are like insane, bro. Oh my God. You know, I I say pretty often I would if I was to ever be a police officer, I wouldn't. Excuse me. Um. I wouldn't be caught in like clutch uh, situations. See. You know, I want to know. I want to see a part two to this, but it's like police officers go through so much, so much every day. And it's like, you got to give them, you know, their props. But it's like, at the same time, some of them be BSing too, man. I'm about to say something else. But man, this whole this whole conversation was just crazy. You know what? I don't understand. And I got a couple of questions. Did he? Hold on, hold on. I have to go back to the beat, very beginning. Oh, where's your emergency? I'm at Trumpet Stone, Orlando. Which is on 7th Avenue. I saw my leg amputated by a bailer. I need a 911 assistance immediately, please. You just had your leg amputated by a bailer? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay. So. Obviously, I think he either passed out. 
or died. Because, as you heard in the beginning, he, he, he had full energy. But as the conversation went on, that energy became less and less and less. So, hopefully, he made it out alive and he was, he was alright to a certain extent. But he said, I, uh, I just had my leg amputated by Baylor. Did he do that on purpose or was it by accident? The reason I say this is because he was like, when my mom finds out, she's going to kill me. Why would he say that to her, like about his mom in a situation that he's in? I, I know any mother or any parent that I know of, if something like that happened to their, to their kid, the last thing they would think about is killing their um their uh their kid. So that 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 kind of threw me off a little bit. I'm like, your mom is sup. She a little sus. She a little sus for you to be saying that. Right. And then also what makes me think you kinda did it on purpose. It's because you said, am I going to get fired for this? If it was by accident, that's work is calm. Right? You would not get fired. But that makes me think you did it on purpose. Because it's like, if you did it on purpose, obviously they're going to fire you. I don't know what the hell would happen if you did it on purpose, though. That's crazy. Mm, that's ridiculous, bruh. Hold on, I don't even know what a. I don't, I'm a, I'm gonna look it up real fast. I don't even know what a what a uh, bailiff is. Hold on, I'm just I'm about to look up a picture of it. I just see pictures of like officers and like when I search bailiff, it's like it's like it's like oh excuse me I farted. It's like I'm seeing I'm seeing pictures of officers, but I'm I'm, I'm mostly seeing pictures of like the officer that stands beside the judge of a courtroom, bailiff. Oh, hey bailiff, that uh, those are the. Uh, is that what they're called? Wait, what? I'm so confused now on everything. Why would the bailiff do that? Holy hell. Oh, God. Wait a minute. Oh, my God. So now that I know what a bailiff is. My whole thought process just changed. So he was in a courtroom? Wait, what? Mm-mm. I am really, really confused. I am so confused right now. That's deep. Mm. That's ironic too, because if like the if the, like if the bailiff did did that to the kid, and he's talking to a police officer on the phone, that's ironic. So that makes me think that the one that he was talking to 
was in cahoots. And then the one that that came right to where he was at was in cahoots. Holy, I got so many questions. I am so confused right now. <laughs> I am so Because originally, I thought a bailiff was just a like a big ass blade. And it just, it, it chops meat. That, wow. You know? Huh. I kind of don't trust bailiffs no more. That, wow. Jesus. Oh. I got, I don't, yeah, y'all was able to tell. I got real emotional when... He started to pray. Oh, man. Because usually when you pray in situations like this, it, it, uh, it might be a wrap for you. You know, you preparing for the worst, but hoping for the best. My condolences, man. Um, oh, wow. Was this real? Was this a real story? Or was this like fake? Cause I, 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 I'm trying to, I'm trying to wrap my head around why a bailiff would do that to him. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I didn't even finish my popcorn either. That's how you know the story was good. Because I didn't even finish my jumps. I just have a lot of questions now. And a lot of concerns. I don't know, man. It's just... Wow. All I know is... Bailiffs... I look at y'all a little bit differently now. And... I did spell that right. Baby. Baby. Oh! Oh, that! I'm, I'm such an idiot. I am such an idiot. Okay, so disregard what I said about the police officer and all that. And like the judge in the courtroom and all. Wow. No, I'm look. I'm I'm looking up a bailer right now, and I'm seeing forklifts and and. Th I'm I'm looking at this. I'm looking at that. Right. So okay, now 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 I see why your leg got in, uh amputated. Oh my god. I may have to go back into the story to see how it happened, but I think it started, I don't think he ever described how it happened. I don't know, maybe because my short-term memory loss, I got like five-second memory loss. So I may have to look back at, at in, the, in, the, in it, but yeah, no, I can see why your, your leg got imitated. But regardless of the fact, I don't know if he still did it on purpose or not, or by accident. I don't know what your intentions was, but... I can definitely see how your leg got amputated. Jesus. Who? Keep who? Get off, man. And because of that, I would feel like somebody would either have have to have have, have to have had years of experience or have somebody watch them while they operate that bailer. That joint, that, that thing is huge. Pause, but yeah. I'm still confused, but I may take out the courtroom and the judge and all that because that was, that, that, I, I, that was stupid why I said that. <laughs>
But hey, keep it cool, keep it classy, and I love you. Stay happy, my family.